wait a minute, guys. Like, why can't I just do with you what I want if I have the power? Like, why is that wrong exactly? Like, it might be inconvenient for you, and you are no doubt going to be motivated to rebel, maybe, if you don't want to succumb, but perhaps you'd be motivated to rebel. But I don't see how you can make a moral case that if I can do it, I shouldn't. If you're going to make the moral case, you have to make the assumption that each person, in some sense, is created in the image of what is sacred, and you can't violate that, regardless of apparent evidence for hierarchical difference. And so it's that spirit, as far as I can tell, we were talking about alternative hypothesis that something like might meant moral virtue and might inspired moral virtue meant right. And that was the ethos that governed everyone everywhere until this strange idea emerged that somehow each person was characterized by intrinsic and viable worth.